the Chosen of Andraste, a blessed hero sent to save us all. Am I riding in on a shining steed? I would have suggested a griffon, but sadly they're extinct. Joke as you will, posturing is necessary. I've journeyed deep into the fade in ancient ruins and battlefields to see the dreams of lost civilizations. I've watched as hosts of spirits clash to reenact the bloody past in ancient wars both famous and forgotten. Every great war has its heroes. I'm just curious what kind you'll be. What do you mean, ruins and battlefields? Any building strong enough to withstand the rigors of time as a history. Every battlefield is steeped in death. Both attract spirits. They press against the veil, weakening the barrier between our worlds. When I dream in such places, I go deep into the Fade. I can find memories no other living being has ever seen. You fall asleep in the middle of ancient ruins. Isn't that dangerous? I do set wards. And if you leave food out for the giant spiders, they are usually content to live and let live. I've never heard of anyone going so far into the Fade. That's extraordinary. Thank you. It's not a common field of study for obvious reasons. Not so flashy as throwing fire or lightning. The thrill of finding remnants of a thousand-year-old dream? I would not trade it for anything. I will stay then. At least until the breach has been closed. Was that in doubt? I am an apostate mage surrounded by Chantry forces, and unlike you, I do not have a divine mark protecting me. Cassandra has been accommodating, but you understand my caution. You came here to help, Solus. I won't let them use that against you. How would you stop them? However I had to. Thank you. But now let us hope either the mages or the Templars have the power to seal the breach.